Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And I gotta be honest with you, because of the whole FOMO panic of 2023, parking is parking is at a premium. I think I've got like three spaces left. One of those has got to be saved for the whole Ghostbusters thing. One of them, I was thinking of getting the uh, the Woody. I'm getting a Woody, getting the... Uh, not that car, no. Getting the Clique Classic, whatever it is, but, you know... Down at, down at three spaces here. Maybe we'll get on the other characters more. I don't know, but... Here are three, I believe, removed cars. I, think, I know the Masakro is, but I have a Masakro. I did get the Masakro. I didn't get an Alpha. An Alpha is one of those cars that I kind of wanted. And it's not like it costs a lot. I mean, I guess we're just going to have to start... Let's put this in the... Um, in Arena Workshop B2 for right now, so that we can completely do it up. Where's the exit? This day, the exit. Oh, yeah, here we go. I'm driving around in the, the company Deity, so you apparently can't bring that in over here. So, can't bring that into the Ellis car meets. It's a company car. But the Alpha is one of those cars that I've always thought had at least an interesting look to it. It's not supposed to be a bad drive. It's not going to win anything, but... Just the kind of car. It's like you wanted to get it, but it's like, well, do I have the space? Do I do really care? It's always there for when I want it, except now it's not, because it removed it from the game. So... Being that this might be my last chance to ever get the Alpha until it shows up in some kind of rotation again. I mean, there's, there's going to come a point where I'm going to start just selling cars that I have that are available. Like, it could get really weird. Ah. Alright, let's check this out. I'm probably going to stick this in. I have one spot in my nightclub. And this seems like a good nightclub and kind of car. It's kind of a miscellaneous garage anyway. Okay, so question number one. What do we think of the paint? Like, I don't mind the red. Yeah, I like a red car, but I think I prefer more of a, a blaze red or grease red kind of look to it. Custom front splitter. Well, I guess we'll do that. Maybe that must be the secondary, I suppose. Yep. Exhaust. I guess those kind of look like aftermarkets that don't fit. Let's leave the stock. Smooth or triple vent? Like that looks more functional. I don't think it looks necessarily more attractive. This is a stock hood. Let's we can always add it later. Lights, headlights. Let's hold off on that. We don't know how we're gonna repaint it. If I do still go with a red. Yeah, that's garnet red. I'm not I'm not a huge fan. Race red now you're kind of you're kind of there for me. It's a nice variation on the theme. With a pearlescent, just red. Cast iron so see that's that's how you get that kind of washed out. Torino red, formula red. Yeah, I think they kind of like the look that as it comes there. All right, secondary color. Chrome? Do we can we move this chrome edges? Kind of a thought. I mean, you know, the least brown definitely isn't working. We can match it up.
you know. Okay, so what if you match it? Eh, it looks a little too plain. There's a straight up kind of silver. You know what? I don't feel like going crazy chrome. Get a wine red highlight to that. Would that be? I think it's either match it or chrome it. Black, you know, carboning it doesn't really go call to me. For now. You can always change it later. You give it like a, a true gold kind of look or something like that. Uh, skirts. Custom skirts. Spoiler. Let's go mid-level. Suspension. I don't know. Do we want to slam this? I guess so. It does look a little bit better that way. Reese transmission. Turbo it up. Wheels. Wheel type. High end. Okay, so those are the stock ones. Blades are nice. Chromatic Z's are always a favorite. That does look good. So we could carbon these up. The carbonic Z's. So I could go carbon Z's and then go carbon highlights on it, and that would work. It's not really calling to me. I think just straight up. Let's go. Let's just try a different take on this. What if we go tuner? What kind of chrome tuners we got? Oh, those look a little chunky. I usually go with like some Driftmeisters or some Slicers or something like that. But ooh, the thing has happened. No. No, I think it's got to be high end. It's just the type of car it is. These these wheels look like they fit. Super G's. The diamond. The blades. The hyper. Shadow. I mean, the sock wheels do have a fancy cut to them. Don't get me wrong. Either Mercy's or Chromatic Z's. There's not much difference between them. We're going to go Chromatic Z's. Tires, tire design, customs. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Lights. Let's leave the headlights. We'll make the headlights white. Neon kit, neon layout, front, back, sides, match the white. There's red on red on red. Eh. We've done that. Plate. I haven't done this in a while. Plate updated. Windows, light smoke.
just pondering the secondary one more time. Okay, so we'd have that's a lot of chrome added to it, to the edges. Now it kind of flows a little bit better. If I don't, I like the red. The ring, this, this puts me more in mind of my own T-Bird, which is not a chromed out chrome mobile, mind you. There's two completely equally good looks here. You may think differently. You may think it you could use that. You've got the opportunity to give it a little bit of character. Why not? Well, yeah, let's matches up the wheels. Could always take it off later. Money's not really an object. We'll save that for the other build. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of like it as it is there. That's again, it, since I'm not going to get a fortune to drive around anyway. You know, my own Thunderbird. Might as well have like a red car, two-door coupe, right? Doesn't look like it at all, but at least it's the right color. So let's go find it at home. Finding it at home is important. I don't know what I'm going to do here because, I mean, really, I could pretty much get one more car. Then pretty soon I'm going to have to start just going through and unloading stuff that I probably don't want to unload. And it probably won't be anything that's unavailable, so, you know. I get rid of my FMJ? I mean, I love my FMJ. Seems to work here, I think. This is especially parked, you know, next to the crossfire. Yeah, this is this is all good. So I know it's a question that obviously we have to answer. Will this thing go up Shiliad? I honestly don't know. I have no idea. But we can certainly find out. Will a fully hopped up Alpha climb Mount Chiliad on the hot lap route? I don't know if that's a question that must be answered, but we're going to answer it anyway. Point to point GTA. This is a sports car, I believe. Is it a sports car? We're going to find out. If it's not a sports car, then we'll be just dumping out. And... I don't think it's a coupe. There aren't a lot of there aren't a lot of two coupes, you know what I'm saying? Have some, uh... Right there! Look at that! Custom Alpha! It just said, hey, we bet you want this. Didn't I say it to noon? I don't know, we get a little bit of a dim day here. Did I leave it at current? I don't know. Not even paying attention. And 
Because that didn't work out. Okay, we worked the edge. Ah, oh, all right, Alpha. Good recovery. We landed it in shallow enough water that it didn't go into the engine. Much. Now, can we get this thing righted before the train comes? Probably not my much, but we're, we're going to keep a move on. Feels good enough. I mean, you know. Ooh, I thought we were going to launch it there. I think the power is good enough that it should be fine going up here. Okay, so far so good. That little jump may have hurt us, but we're going to just power on up. Unless something kills the momentum big time, if we're losing it. I think it will have enough. There we go. Must have picked morning. I don't know. It's a different look. Seems to be a really good chili odd car. I don't know if that would hold for one you found on the you know on the street without turbo. But then, I guess this isn't really for useful information. This is just what we do here. I wonder if I could get it by slamming it off the, uh, off the front side. That is the standard method. It seems a pretty good grip, to be perfectly honest with you, for being a two-wheel drive. I think it's a two-wheel drive. The new bike location there. Is that, is that where the um, time trial is this week? Is up here? Is that where we're seeing that? Very likely. Okay, it's definitely a rear-wheel drive. A solid, solid rear-wheel drive. It's good. Oh, here, here we go. Ugh, I tried to yeet it between the trees. That did not end well. Fine, flip over. Oh dear, this thing likes a turtle. Boom, oh, okay. Yeah, back up, righted. Going where we want to go. A little worse for wear. Wow, it was really It's a yeet mode! Oh, ow, ooh, oh, ooh, ew, oh, ow, ooh, ow, yippee, 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 ooh. Nope. Alright, this is, this is very big nopes. It's funny nopes. I don't want to get hung up here. I'll keep on one slab. Yeah, the train's coming. Train's not my biggest problem right now. The biggest problem is once the train goes past, I have to make sure I get back to the railroad tracks. Mm -hmm. 
Yeet! Alright, we did it. No problem with the secondary yeet there. It's a mellow sounding car. It's a good performing car. Too bad you can only get it for a limited time only. Because FOMO. This is a FOMO car. One of the cars conscripted to the realm of FOMOdocracy. Oh, what did we hit? I didn't even notice. Was it a bush? Seems a little touchy at times. That does make a uh, a hindrance. Look, I have never seen that happen before. Why did it explode? I was just doing the dismount. Oh my goodness! You gotta be kidding me. All right, well, it has a definite Achilles heel here. I mean, all it hit was the front bumper. I mean, it just exploded. Like, come on now. We'll try to take care of it better on the way down, but that wasn't that beat up. I did put armor on this, did I not? Almost positive I put armor on it. That wasn't taking good care of it. Yeah, I didn't put armor on it. I'll double check. Does it ha not have armor? Is it something weird? Did we start with brakes or something? I don't know. I thought we put armor on this. Well, there you can see the engine. There goes the hood. I've never blown up on the dismount from the rails before. That was... Give it some air control to pull up the nose when we're doing that? I don't know. Yeah, that was really... That was... That was bizarre. Any car that kind of acts periodically like a bottle of nitroglycerin, you know, it's hard to recommend for a G-Fred route. Now, I drove right in that side at flank speed, it didn't blow up. Why did it blow up when I hit I don't know. That's some funky physics. Almost sneak past. At least it didn't explode. It, you know, I think it had enough power to make the jump, but the bushes. It doesn't like the bushes. Oh, 
Oh, I thought that was going to explode again. He was like, it's going nose in. No. Freaks, freaks, freaks. Wobbly dabbly. All right, this 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 alpha has seen better days, but we're almost there. <laughs> Photo finish at the uh, at the line there with a non-participant. I'm the wiener. Let's go back to the free modes. I like this. This is, this is, you know. A nice set of wheels. It's got that weird, uh, looks like there's some kind of mechanical spider in the intake that's going to eat you. That's just the shading of the lightning there, but, you know, still. A little rough, but you know, it's okay. Interior. Trunk. Hooray. And so now, we switch over. Let's see if we have enough room and Enough will to get one for the Rusty Jack. Rusty Jack, how would you like to take time out of your busy day to go buy and modify an Alpha? We won't make you take it up the hill. How's that sound? We're just, we're just going to make it pretty and park it somewhere. Thanks. Thank, thanks for that. That's just lovely. Just for that, we're going to stick in the public. First things first, we need a set of wheels. Yeah, this will do fine. Get us to the LS car meet. Oh, look at that. There's another, uh, another stash house. We could hit that. Might trigger us... Uh, it goes to the bunker, then I'll probably have to go and sell the bunker. So it doesn't overfill the bunker. But hey, these are risks we're willing to take, right? What I should do while we're here. Because we're right here. Make sure we have parking. That's a... That's a thing. Because parking's at such a premium. Never heard that one before. How is this ironic? Don't you think? Is it too ironic? Do you really do think? Okay, those took up some spots and some spots. There's one spot here. Um, that's a little disturbing. V1. Now 
man. I think we're in trouble. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. No, we're not. Stop it. Hmm. Do I only really only have one spot? Well, you know what we could do? We could build it, and if we end up having to sell it, well, so it is. We'll sell something else. I don't know. FOMO. Maybe we'll end up not getting a Ghostbuster for this one or something. We'll have to see how cool that is. So we can always just sell the Alpha that I'm about to get, even though it'll be technically irretrievable and irreplaceable. I will have one. Drug dealers, there's stash houses. Hey, we'll deal with the stash house while we're waiting for this to deliver and then... Figure something out for parking. What if there's a, a case for a video series where I just look at all the cars here? Okay, so we step up, we purchase 150k. B2 for now. I could probably do... Oh, wait, am I running right past my own car? It's so low. To just to ride the button. Like, we really do need another garage at this point. I know, Rockstar. You thought, oh, well, this... This this one, this 50-car garage, that'll be the last garage you'd ever need. Why would you need anything beyond that? Oh, well, then, you know. I wasn't the one who made all the cars, like, you know, limited time only, so you don't have to get everything whenever you can get everything, and it's just FOMO, 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 FOMO. You know what? I'm angry about FOMO, so here, eat that. The one in there. You know, everybody in there has been killed. Shouldn't you be a little concerned? Fucking animal. Okay, let's not dwell too much on the fire. All right, it's before it burns up. Seventy-three, twenty-seven, thirty-eight. Seventy-three, twenty-seven, thirty-eight. Just, just got that in time. 73... Let's see if I've screwed the numbers up in my head already. Not what the usual number says. Nyomp. Oddly enough, I think you can still read it. This place is burning down and you really should leave because, you know... Come get me! I should be bulletproof from behind. And way faster than what they're dealing with.
You want to sell drugs? Hey man, you want to buy some drugs? I'm a terrible person. I can sell you drugs. I'm trying to sell everything. I only let me sell one of acid. And acid. I don't think I just sold my acid. Yeah, I guess. Bye. Oh, we've exhausted all that. I love the Tyrus. I mean, it's, it's such an undervalued vehicle. Where are we going? I don't even know where we're going. We're, we're not far. I did not notice. What did we, uh, what did we get when we cleared the stash house? I need to go sell my... Bunker next. Well, we'll deal with that later. Perhaps his bonus material. So, last car in the shop. What do we gotta do with this? This is just getting out of control. All these irreplaceable cars. Definitely put the armor on this time, but... Eh, still leaving that alone. We'll vent this one, what the heck. Don't know what we're doing yet there. Respray. Primary color. I'm kind of open on this one. Do whatever. I don't do a lot of silver cars. Can't get the lime green anyway, but it wasn't really calling to me. And not another purple. Here we are in the realm of the blues. The light blue? Just go with a light blue. We want to do a, uh, a Ron livery one? No, we're not doing Ron. We'll go do yellow and some do yellow black kind of stuff. Regular yellow. Yellow. Pink? Haven't done a pink. It would be a pink Cadillac. Do we want to go the pink Cadillac route? Oh, man. I don't know. Don't know if that's calling to me. I've already done the reds. Black is... I don't want to say black is whack, because black works okay, but... Okay, we'll go diamond blue. Pearlescent. There's something weird about the lights on that, isn't it? Pearlescent diamond blue over... Give it a straight up silver look to it. I think the lighting here is making it look a little bit green. Silver over diamond. And then. Secondary color. What if we went with metallic? Or even like a matte, matte black? They don't have a carbon. We have to go through metallic. If you want carbon black. And we could do that. We could chrome it up. I'm thinking with this color, if I did that and then put some, you know, get with these wheels have some, some carbon in them, that might work as opposed to 
See, with the light on light. Fully chrome it or, or carbon it up. Chrome it. Let's, let's get silly. Skirts, absolutely. More chrome. Spoiler. Even more chrome. Suspension in the weeds. Transmission, do the deeds. Turbo it, wheel, wheel type, high end. Chrome rims. Gap shadows, why not? Some bulletproofs on this thing. Where's the lights again? Now we're. I'm thinking, yeah, I don't want to go blue on this. Just leave it kind of bright and white and take it outside. Not a bad build. I mean, are we going to end up keeping it? It's going to depend. It's going to depend. I have to canvas my garage and see if I have any room anywhere. I put anything in there. Did I put anything in the office that has, you know, there's a room there? I don't know. We're going to have to figure it out. But for right now, this is that. Um, just for clarity, what did we what did we get? Let us do potentially our fine new session. Let's try to do a public bunker run here and what time is it? Is it like lunch? Yeah, it's like quarter to one. Because we'll see if, if if it filled the bunker, then, you know, then I really need to sell it. If it didn't, I can let it sit forever until this doesn't become more than a solo thing. Just having done that, it may be a little bit overfilled as it is, but we're just going to deal. You don't have to worry about the acid lab because it's always a solo run. You don't have to worry about the, the uh, biker businesses because I'm just not going to do them. Not until it's, you know, doble money and then you're willing to go through the work. No, but didn't fill this one. It filled some melt. You can see it. You can scroll back here. I'm still recording. But hey, who's who we got in game here? Who we got? Who's what kind of players? What have we got here? <coughs> Lots of style. But is there any guile? Any miners? Somebody just got shot. I think this is a potential to just get uh, to just get bonus. We'll see. If it ends badly, uh, not really concerned. I should make back the cost of one of these not with modifications but one of these things make a little money back again not that I'm overly concerned Ah, uh, fear by fear. In case you were worried about selling these arms and them not getting used we got a buyer airlifting this shipment right into a hot zone You'll need big off-roaders to get to the pickup sites, so get in the cab and get on the road. Where are we going? This is not too bad a run. 
tactical up there. I could probably retire the AP pistol. And then you know, put it in the in the gun locker, and then just I don't think it'll will default to the tactical. I think it'll be defaulting to like the uh, flare gun or something. And it's like, all right, well, let's just um, have it. If for some reason I'm caught unawares, and I pull out the first thing that comes up, the AP pistol is still a good gun. This is just a smidge better. All right, let's see. That wasn't a bad entry point, really. Here come the chopper commandos. Booga booga. Machine gun, machine gun. Okay, so we got one of the gunners. So if we let them live, it'll just be consistently less bullets raining down on us. Whereas if I shoot it down, then another helicopter will come back with a fresh gunner. And none of us want that. No, none of us do. Shot the engine there. I guess I should be glad it doesn't go go boom. Of course, that wouldn't be what happened anyway. But this is GTA. This is bad. Okay, I think because that guy was spamming the chat, he hung it for a minute. Come to my website. Give me money. I'll help you cheat. how much business they actually get from that or is it just annoy people and well, I might buy a mod menu but it's not gonna be yours no siree Bob so it would normally be 210 what do we come up with here what was that 15. So technically speaking, I paid for the base cost of both cars, and all I'm into them for then is the uh, the upgrades, which is a huge hooray! Hooray! Ooh, ooh, ooh. All right. Looks like you sold out to the right people too. Only the good wars being fought with those guns. Promise. Now, on this note, ladies and gentlemen, I think I think this is a good place to call it quits. This is your Black Knight. Well, not like quits forever, but like for this video. This is your Black Knight. Have a great night.